What is up guys, Lost Memories here, and today, I'll be talking about why I think Ryu is one of the best characters in Smash 4. Now listen, listen. Some of y'all might think that that's a freaking huge, huge overstatement, but like now I have, what's it called, but like now that I like sit down and I was playing Smash 4 earlier, and I, I finally recognized that Ryu was actually a really good character. Of course, in my opinion, nobody's gonna be, ba uh, what's it called, um, do I bail not a metagame, metagame currently, because we all know that she got the back of free combos. But the thing about Ryu is that first of all, like with like his focus punch, he can take many hits, and because he can take many hits, or not, well not many hits, but like exactly one hit, not including multi-hitting moves, because of course multi-hitting moves is a multi-hitting move, it's not one hit. But like knowing that, like what you call it, ledge traps won't exactly work on him because of that one move. That's like a really good thing, good thing, considering that um that ledge trap traps are like really 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 strong in smash 4 in freaking general also this guy hits like a freaking truck his like true or his like true shard you can is one of the hardest okay let me, let me say this it kills super freaking early and like not only that but like Ryu has so many combos that can lead into true shard you can including his amazing freaking up to and heavy up to which kills super early in in which call it light up to does, does not kill by itself don't get me wrong but it's basically almost a true follow-up with a true Sharyuken, which is very, very good in the metagame, or like, you know, um, or like in the neutral. Now, like, Ryu, of course, Ryu has his Hadouken and his, um, I have not, I'm sorry for, um, I'm sorry, because I don't know how to say this, but, um, his, like, red, or, like, oranges, Hadouken, like, I'll run and call it, I have no idea what the freak it's called, but, you know, like, but, like, you know, like, that's what I'm gonna call it. He can what you call it? He can also have the power to speed up or slow those down, which is pretty freaking amazing. Considering that, like again, Ryu has already a pretty good neutral game, even freaking without the Hadouken, because of how powerful and strong he is. He can also take hits and smash attacks with the right Smash DI and SDI. Wait a minute, that's the exact same thing. Okay, what's still though? And with um, with the correct directional input and stuff like that. Now, now let's get in, in terms of what Ryu can do. Ryu has a lot of potential, and I think that um, and I think that Dark Shad is like one of the people, um, one of the people of the Smash for Ryu community that really takes Ryu to his like his like fullest potential. Not there, like you know, like you know, just like any other character yet. But almost there, like, you know what I'm saying? Because, like, because, like, in my, in my opinion, like, after I saw this video, which is a couple months old by now, but still, that doesn't despite the fact that Ryu was, is a really, really good character in this game. And the reason why I think he's, um, now I'm gonna go over this again. My main reasons why I think that Ryu is the best character in the game is because of this. Well, not because of character in the game, because, of course, Bayonetta is still exists. But, you know, th but the reason why is because he has a very strong neutral game. His Hadouken can get, well, I don't, I'm, not, I'm not gonna say Hadouken, what's that? Like, like, red Hadouken? No idea how to, you know, say it, or whatever. His focus attacks completely obliterate freaking ledge control in freaking general, because, like, you can take one hit, and usually, like, you want to do one hit, at, like, just, just like that. That example right there, Dirk Dirk tried to take a hit without, you know, having any, um, any, like, consequences. And you can cancel all of it, which is very important. And look at that. True Sharyuken, right there. That's like another thing. He like hits like a truck, but like he can also take hits. And he's what you call it? He's not too fast, but not too slow. I would say, in my heart, or like in my opinion, Ryu will be right behind Bayonetta. He's not like broken or anything like that. But here's the thing. Like for like like um, if I ever make a Smash for tier list, it'll probably be Bayonetta Ryu, then Cloud. Yes, Cloud. He, like what you call it? Cloud is fairly broken. Duh. <laughs> yeah, you know, especially with freaking Lemon King Kai Kai over here. But the thing, but the thing that kind of pushed, look at that. You didn't even see the frame come out or anything like that. It just kills. That's another thing. True Shard is like really, 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 really freaking fast. And like, like what's called? And like, if Ryu can space roll, he will like, what's, okay, here's the thing. Ryu can get comboed pretty freaking hard. Not like harder than like, what's called? Like heavyweight character, like Bowser, DDD, or even Donkey Kong, and you know, and like, you know, freaking etc. But, but, but once Ryu gets in, he gets in. Like, what I mean he gets in, I mean, like, he, like, does a whole bunch of combos that can, pull it, that can like, potentially kill out the right percent. As you can see, zero is at 41% right now. 
he can kill him at that percent. Like that's how strong Ryu is as a like as a whole as a character. If you really know how to play Ryu, then the trust and believe your, your opponents most likely gonna have a bad time. And no puns intended <laughs> towards Undersell there. But but yeah. So in my opinion, do I think Ryu needs a nerf? No, I do not think Ryu needs a nerf. I think Ryu is a perfectly um. Well, I'm not gonna say balanced character because he's obviously not a balanced character. I put him this high, but like um, but. But Ryu has his ups and downs, and like he can, oh, what to call it, and like he can combo, like, well, actually, like, yeah, Ryu can combo a lot. That, just like I said, if he gets in, that's probably a KO, and if it's not a KO, it's, it's, if it's probably not a KO, then like, you're probably gonna take a lot of damage, depending on the person that's playing Ryu, of course. So, in my opinion, I'll put Ryu second in the tier list behind Bayonetta, and that, this is the reason why I think that Ryu is the best character in the game. Thanks for watching. We're not the well, second best character in the game, I guess. Thanks for watching. Do, do not forget to like, comment, subscribe. It's all memories. I am out. Peace and have a good one.